guys it's CC the personality and welcome back to my channel so today I'm freaking excited and that's because this is my first fashion haul so I've actually been wanting to do this video for a long a long time now but y'all know when you order stuff from China like it take like three million years to come and all of my things they came separately they're finally here another thing that prolonged this video is the fact that Hurricane Irma just decided to slide through Florida and mess stuff up I had no electricity no nothing and that's why I've been MIA for a little minute but I'm back and I'm better and I'm starting off with this video so you guys give me a thumbs up very quickly if you're new to my channel welcome subscribe right now like hold on i'm gonna give y'all a couple seconds to subscribe five four three two all right i hope y'all subscribe i'm watching you I'm watching you. All right, y'all. I got a lot of cute stuff to show you. I got pants. I got shirts. I got, what else I got? Accessories. I got makeup. I have a lot of things to show you. So let's just jump right in the video. Before we officially start, everything that I show you today is going to be in the description box. I'm going to also attach a link just in case you want to order it and I'm going to show you the price. So the first thing that I bought that I'm going to show you is actually the shirt that I have on right now. It's a pink Barbie shirt and I bought it for $6.63. Now this shirt took about two weeks to come in. Um, the things came separately like I said. Some things came around the same time and some things didn't. Some came a little earlier than expected and some came way later. So this shirt took about two weeks to come in. I really liked it because I don't know I like girly stuff and I looked in my closet and I noticed that I only had all black clothes so I wanted to order some clothes with color and I felt that this was a cute shirt. One of the things I don't like about this shirt is that you can tell it's from China, let's be real. Clothes from China, they don't have the best quality. As you can see, there are some pulled threads. The letters looked ironed on, literally ironed on. I don't know if you noticed, but like as soon as I put it on, this is my first day wearing it to school. The letters just look very ironed on, like it's bending, it's breaking, but it's from China. What else can I expect, really? I did order this shirt in a large and it is it's very small I don't know why I ordered it in the large um usually when you order things from this site you should look at different reviews I don't order things that don't have reviews because I need to see how my stuff gonna look but it said that the shirt runs kind of big which was a lie because the shirt I got ran very very small so definitely if you want to order this shirt get a couple sizes up just so you'll feel comfortable the next shirt I purchased was a camo t-shirt now y'all I've been looking for a camo t-shirt for a long time I bought one from forever 21 for I guess the same price the camo t-shirt was nine dollars and fifty one cents and I think I believe it was nine sixty at forever 21 and it was not even cute the one at forever 21 but this camo t-shirt is the exact camo that I wanted the one from forever 21 looked cheesy to me so I returned it and I bought this one and this is one of the purchases that I'm 100% happy with. It looks like a very good quality shirt. I wanted a camo shirt and I got a good one. So I'm happy about this purchase. I did order it a couple of size larger because of the fact that I saw reviews that said it ran small. So I ordered it in an extra large and it fits me perfectly. I like my shirts to fit a little bit like baggier. I don't like tight shirts at all. So this shirt fit perfectly. Next is one of my favorite, favorite purchases, and that's this Yeezy shirt. Now, this Yeezy shirt is actually this Feezy shirt because, yes, it's fake. It is fake, fake, fake. And I'm going to tell you why. In no way do I support nor like Kanye West. He is, I'm not going to go, I'm not going to go into that, but I do not support Kanye West. And usually when I support someone, um, I would buy their product, like, Brianna Fenty foundation I support her so I bought it but I don't support Kanye West that's a whole nother rant that I'll have to go on so and but I like the shirt so I say you know what I'm gonna get this shirt 
and there's no way he's getting money out of it because of where I ordered it from so I like the shirt I bought it for $18 and I actually just got off his website and his shirts with that same style the long sleeve shirts ranges from 65 to 85 dollars and even if I did like him I was not paying that much for a long sleeve shirt so either way it wasn't happening but this shirt looks exactly like the real one the only only complaint I have about it is the fact that the arms is too big it's like too baggy and I don't like that but I could completely roll it up and make it look fine for $18 and it was supposed to be an $85 shirt I think that was good the quality is amazing it looks exactly like the original one I got this shirt in a size extra large because that was the smallest size they had and like I said I like my shirts to fit baggy I wanted it in a large but it was fine I still like the way that it fits another one of my favorite purchases from this haul were these leggings and on the website it says that they're trousers but they're not they're leggings they're spandex material and they fit like leggings and they're really comfortable I love the little lace-up look they were only ten dollars and ninety two cents so you know I had to get them the only complaint I would really say about them is the fact that you have to lace them up yourself y'all I'm telling y'all I lace these pants up I think four times because each time I laced it up I realized that I was missing a hole and you have to unravel the whole thing when you miss one hole or it's just gonna look awky so that's very tedious and that was my only complaint but other than that I really love them they run very big I ordered it in a size medium and they were still kind of like a little baggy so if you're a skinny person I would probably not order it because their small size is not very small so for my thicker girls you got options boo my next purchase was a camo two-piece set and I paid twelve dollars and ninety nine cents for it this two-piece set was very 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 comfortable um it looked exactly like how it looked on the website I love the hoodie if you know me I love hoodies I might not even use them but the fact that the hoodie is there makes it look cute to me so I love this um two-piece set it's a very stretchy spandex material also so it's really comfortable I I ordered it in a size large so these are one of the products that is true to size so I would order this in the size that you usually order your clothes now this striped two-piece set was $12.40 and I ordered it in a size large you guys if there was a purchase that I would not purchase again it would be this one I'll explain why so basically I wanted when I saw it it did not look anything like how I received it when you look at it on the website it looks like it's made out of a cotton material but when you get it it's a spandex stretchy material and I would have I wouldn't have ordered it in white um if I would have known that because of the fact that it's so see-through especially on the bottoms which means that you would definitely need to wear black or new panties or you know you just gonna expose yourself to the world and that's not cute so um they do sell this two-piece set in black I definitely would get it in black and see if it's still see-through at the on the back but I just wish like I said it was a little bigger and baggier um and I wish it was cotton like how it looked on the picture but I still think it's cute I'll still wear it it's not nothing that I would never wear it's just like you have to be cautious with when you wear it and what you wear it with so yeah now these beautiful beautiful lashes that I actually have on right now were two dollars and 76 cents mink lashes y'all I forgot to mention that they are mink lashes for two dollars and 76 cents and these are my first pair of mink lashes and they are so cute people be selling it on Instagram for like 20 25 dollars but I'm not first of all y'all trying to rip people off because y'all know all y'all do is get it off at of Aliexpress like y'all other girls who be selling hair but I'm not gonna talk about that right now these eyelashes are worth the buy they come with three pairs so three sets of eyelashes for two dollars and 76 cents I need to order some more the only thing about these lashes is they take forever to come in literally forever like I think they well they definitely just came last week and I ordered them two months ago so if you want these lashes order it like right now like 
take your phone out and order it right now now my stunner shades y'all my stunner shades they cost six dollars and 59 cents y'all i really love these glasses when i saw them i was like i need this for when somebody tried me i could just put on my stunner shades and just walk away because that's like these are those glasses that's like i'm feeling myself and you feeling me glasses <laughs> but no for real i love these glasses because they make me look bougie er then i already am i love them <laughs> The only complaint I have about these glasses is the fact that they're really delicate. So, knowing me, I throw things in my bag all the time. And one time I did do that with these glasses and they bent a little bit. And I was like, oh my gosh. But I realized that um, I could bend it back. So these glasses are really delicate. But a good thing about them is they come with, I don't know what it's called. It's like a fiber dust thing that you use to clean your glasses it comes with that so that's a plus but be careful with the glasses because they can break easily and they're very bendable so be careful now the last thing that I purchased are these beautiful gold vintage glasses you guys these glasses are so cute when I saw them like how I saw the um my stunner glasses I was like I need this because this is different and not a lot of people are gonna have this and it was really special to me because of the detailing you guys the detailing is so beautiful but the only thing is your girl got a big head I got a bobble head like my head is ginormous so these glasses to me to me they don't fit my face they're kind of too small for my face which is why I'm very selective on when I wear them because you know I got a big head that's what happens when you smart you get a big head but if you have a small head get these glasses I'm still gonna wear them though but you know Okay guys, that's the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed watching as much as I enjoyed filming it for you. If you want me to do another fashion haul, let me know in the comment section below. Give me a huge thumbs up for my first haul, y'all. My first haul. I finally got it done. If you saw my Fenty review, that's actually the video posted before this one, then these are the lashes that I was wearing in that video. Give me a huge thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel i love y'all i love y'all i love y'all and i'll see y'all in my next video